Janice is coming in for a visit today. Can you check the registry and update her immunization history? I sure can. Hey, did you actually know that we can do that inside PCC EHR now? I had no idea. Can you show me? Of course. In her chart, go to the immunization history. Then click the Retrieve IMS button. The registry finds a patient who matches Janice's demographic information. We should take a look at that and make sure it's the right person before we move on to her vaccine history. Based on the demographic information they sent back, it looks like it's the right patient. I agree. Let's click Next. Here's where we could review her vaccine history, diseases, and forecasting from the registry. Why are the dates in the vaccine history different colors? The black dates are already in her chart in PCC EHR, but the orange dates are not. We can import the orange dates into her chart in the next screen. All of the dates that were in orange on the last screen now show up here. You can deselect any that you don't want to import. It appears that the registry vaccines are named differently than ours. How do I know if they will import them correctly? The import is based on CVX codes. For example, the registry vaccine named PCV13 will be imported into PCC EHR as Prevnar13 because they share a CVX code. That makes sense. But wait, if it automatically maps items together based on CVX codes, why are there several choices for DTaP Hep B IPV? It looks like we have a couple of immunizations in our system that have the same CVX code as DTaP Hep B IPV. We can select whichever one we want to use for the import. I'll choose the first one. Okay. And how about the Hib and Flu down there? Why can't I import those? Those are grayed out because none of our immunizations in PCC EHR are configured with matching CVX codes. We'll have to update our configuration with help from PCC support before we can import those dates. Can I import everything else and deal with those later? Absolutely. Let's go ahead and click the Import button. All of the dates you selected for import now show up right away in Janice's immunization history. Is there somewhere I can see more details about the imported entries? Yep. Click the Edit IMS button at the bottom of the screen and you'll see that you can edit these or manage them just like you would any other immunization in the history. That was insanely easy. Can every PCC client do this? The feature is being rolled out one registry at a time. Anyone who's interested in signing up to use this once it becomes available in their state should contact PCC support to get the ball rolling. And I bet there's more information about this on learn.pcc.com too. That's right. Just go to learn.pcc.com and search import immunizations. The first article in the search results has written instructions you can follow along with screenshots.